It's not easy being a lizard in a man's world. With success, there's always someone trying to scale you down. He made making it easy look easy. Humans want to be him. Everyone wants to be insured by him. There's secrets behind those beautiful brown eyes. You love him or hate him, you've got to respect him. He didn't ask for this fame. Name a mascot more influential than the gecko. That is what makes him legendary. My daughter drew that. Pretty good, she's only 16. My friend Mike's daughter drew that, it's a little bit better. Should have had her do the other ones too. Filming a doc for the gecko. It's about gecko and about us, the whole town. So yeah, if you just take a seat. Okay, all right. Okay, like that, that's yeah. good. From a very young age, yeah, he was different. But when it came to helping people, the gecko was born ready. And you know, I used to put him to bed and I used to rock him to sleep and sing him. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. I thought he was asleep, but he opened his eyes and he said, Auntie, is that boat insured? And I didn't know what to say. Oh, dear little G. And look at that, look at that. That's after I gave him a bath. <laughs> look at him. And there is, there's the gecko in me. That's my favorite picture. It's my favorite picture. Yeah. Hey, slow down. Geico helps find the right coverage for your car and home. You're not my dad. He wasn't everybody's cup of tea, you know. Some kids thought he was different. He was unusual, and you know how kids are. When people tease you, but you're special, they you start using your special skills and show them what you got. It was first period in the hallway, and uh, he was just, he was standing next to his locker, and uh, you know, he was having a hard time getting into it, so I thought I'd go over and see if I could help. You know, I, I noticed, I mean, he's, uh, you know, on the smaller side, small hands, you know, but uh, there's something about him, something about him. Let's no. bring that Are out. Are you, um, oh, look at this. <laughs> and can you see this? He was a team leader, he was a vocal leader. Uh, you know, the other players went to him. Yeah, all sorts of questions. It was mostly about coverage. I mean, life is hard, but insurance shouldn't be. You know, and, and I told him that in high school. Me, I did. But, you know, somehow the kid already knew that. Well, sure, he's the Geico Gecko, but I mean, he's my best friend. Well, he was always a good kid. You know, I was always the wild one. I was getting written up for detentions, and he was getting written up in the local paper for excellence in insurance. And his parents argued with me. They wanted him to become a doctor. I said, no, he wants to do insurance, and he's good at it. By the time he got to Geico, he could cover anything. I mean, <laughs> just about anything. Yeah. Um, I'm Leslie, and I work at Geico, and I work with the Gecko. I mean, okay, so I thought I was going to be a fragrance engineer. That was my big plan. Uh, but then I was, you know, doing job applications, and I was watching a lot of TV because it's easier. And I was, I just saw a lot of Geico commercials. And I just got inspired. And, like, there's, like, nothing that could smell as good as, like, having really good insurance, like, feels. Because that's a thing people say, right? I roll into the office, 5 o'clock in the morning, Gecko's already there. He wasn't just awake before us. He'd already worked out how to find the perfect protection for way more than cars. He would do it so easily, it wasn't hard for him, you know? I look up to him, I, I, he inspires me, and I, yeah, I, I watch everything he does uh, in, in a normal way. I've been working with the Gecko for 20 long years. I'm great at insurance, but Gecko is just, he's, he's something else. We're talking renters, jewelry, pet insurance. And then he'd come back at night and study film. Made me question if reptiles even sleep, you know? Riddle me this. If it's so easy, a caveman can do it. Why is he working so hard? 
<laughs> hey, caveman, how is the end? Hey, Jimbo. Hey, guys, we're going to take a little uh, pit stop over here in this guy's yard. Yeah, I've been adopting dogs, but they've really been adopting me. <laughs> Bundles of unconditional love. I wish I would have found them earlier, would have saved me years of therapy. <laughs> Jane over here, we do hot yoga, and uh, Phil, I see him over at the lodge. Yeah, why not? You miss the light? You miss the spotlight? <laughs> not a chance. Look at me. I'm in paradise. Sometimes it's just time to smell the flowers, right? See? Yeah, I stick with the native plants. You know, I wonder if the gecko has this sort of setup. Well, gecko's caught up in his own thing. I was there once. Hollywood's not for me. <laughs> no, I don't work for Geico. I never have. I have to admit, you know, I wanted to like him. He's a likable guy, but, I mean, quite frankly, it's a little annoying with the billboards and the pictures and the TV and everything. It's car insurance, right? Finding a proper role model, I think, uh, was something my mother always wanted for me. And I think uh, the qualities of the gecko fit the bill. So this is your first gecko con? Oh, no. No, it's actually our fourth gecko con. Yeah. And so what are you, tell me about your costumes. Oh, well, I am I'm early podium gecko. So I'm when he was just starting out, just figuring himself out. So good. Uh, and I'm Geckosaurus, uh, the, the largest iteration of it uh, can be sort of best summed up for... Uh... Oh, hello there! My stepmother, Tammy, she's not the most enthused. I don't really care for her anyways, so it's fine. I think she's gonna come around. She will come around. With enough love and time, she'll come around. See, some of these people been in line for like days. I figured out a hack. I know, I, I know a guy that works on the inside. He was like, hey man, if you come here around 12 hours before, I got you. Oh man, you can't put a price on these right here. But they were $155. Yeah. Do you think he's kind of reached like saturation? Saturation? I don't even think we've seen his peak yet. You can't overstate the gecko's influence on culture. He's got cartoons, breakfast cereals. The O is for awesome. My kids eat the gecko cereal every day. And then, and then I think I have it on me. Trading card. I'm going to sell it online. And he still comes through, and he helps mom file a claim without breaking a sweat. He influenced an entire generation. Entire generation. Entire generation. I mean, just look at us. Hmm. Get over it. I mean, we're talking about a lizard, right? Listen, when you're a gecko and you're that helpful, people want to put you under a microscope. What's wrong with them? Not a lot of people know this, but the gecko is actually left-handed. Wow, <laughs> left-handed! What? He's left-handed. How did I miss You can see by the way he holds the microphone when he comes to the podium. Whatever. I've shaken both hands. They're both amazing. Uh, it drives me crazy. I mean, I don't want to speak to it one way or the other, but I'll just say people need to leave him and alone and let him have his privacy. What hand he chooses to use is his dominant hand. That's his business and no one else's. Also, is it that big a deal? It's his left, he is left-handed. Should I not say that? Gecko. Uh, yeah, I suppose. Yeah, I'm right here with him. Uh, how is it going? It's going great. Yeah, just showing him the old, uh, old downtown. This is kind of near and dear to my heart. He's got the youth baseball and softball leagues. I got two girls, they both play. Um, my six-year-old, this is a, the age range is six to 16. It's a big, so she's getting smoked by the 16-year-olds. That's also how he played baseball, because he never even swung. His strike zone was like, he had a thousand on base percentage. Couldn't pitch to him. This place commemorates the gecko whose boundless enthusiasm and perseverance once graced this very park. Anyway, it's too long to read, but it's pretty nice. Does it scale? It's perfectly to scale. We were gonna do a big, tall statue, but bronze is a lot more expensive than you'd think. So, word to the wise, if you wanna make a statue of someone lifelike, pick a hero that's short. You'll save a lot of money. I always told him you got too much to offer the world to stay in this small town. I told him you gotta get out of here. And then one day he did, and I uh, actually never did think he would leave. It made me really sad. When he left, I felt vindicated in a way. Like, his success is our success. 
Like he may have moved on, but in a way it's like he took our town and the way we help each other and gave it to the world. I mean, we, we had to pee him a few times. You know, he doesn't look exactly like this. You know, you know this, this isn't scale size. Yeah, you know, obviously, I mean, we have regular size kids at our school. I, I had a lot of input, yeah. I had a lot of input. I mean, I had some input. Yeah. Said that, uh, that you were the biggest influence on his professional and personal life. Really? He said that. Okay. okay. Thank you, Gecko. Not just for helping me with learning the insurance game, but for everything. From the very bottom of, of my heart, thank you. Thank you for bringing our family together. You've helped make insurance easy, but you've also helped me. Your auntie loves you, but you're still my little G, and I am so proud of you. I'm proud of you. I want you to keep doing what you're doing. And remember what I told you. You know, never forget where you came from. And always do your morning push-ups. It's a trip to think about how right now he's just out there somewhere bundling, you know. Do I want to say anything to the gecko? No, but I do want to say something to you. I hope uh, we settle our cash payment for today's participation of this ruse. He's actually pretty tall for a gecko, I will say. You know, people always say he's short. Well, yeah, compared to a human, but I'm small compared to a rocket ship. Hey, Leslie, it's hump day. Wednesdays are hard for me. His parents didn't have an accent, but he spent his summers with me. We talk about life and love and insurance. Frisbee. Use it for golf. <laughs> Booyah. <laughs> Show us what you got. Show us cheese steak, cheese steak. Every day, cheese steak. Every day, cheese steak. All Everyone night, every you. day, 2 a.m., cheese steak. In my short career in insurance, you know, I. I wasn't good enough to do it on the field. I admit that. But he was. He was. But I like to think I had something to do with that. Yeah. Do oppression of the gecko. Yeah, I could. Uh, my wife says it's pretty good. Uh, hi, I'm the gecko. Can I open the door for you? You used to always do that. Uh, I want to go scuba diving. Love scuba diving. You know, the announcement, hold on, I just want to tie my shoe. I, no, I'm in the dark. You've been the lizard of my life. <laughs> Will you be my she gecko and be my wife? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> you mean it? I mean it. You think I could be in a Geico commercial? Nah, probably get camera shy anyway. <laughs>